So what's going on guys, Mr. Dalek JD here and welcome back to part 2 of the Exo Zombies Carrier Easter Egg. In this, we're going to be using the Plinko machine and we're going to be getting ourselves a very nice tablet which is part of the items that is needed in order to unlock the vault. Now this is a very, very difficult step. So I want to tell you guys this now, this is like the hardest step I've ever had to do ever in an Easter Egg for zombies ever. This really is very, very difficult and I promise you, you will not get this on your first attempt but I'll try and explain this as simply as possible so in order to do this you need to do step one that will be linked down below in the description and there'll be a playlist link as well for you guys to check this out but what we need to do is once you've flicked on the generator, it's going to activate the Plinko machine and you're going to see some new kind of like colored dials on here which were not on there previously. Now what we need to do is we need to light up these three kind of bulbs on the right so they're all green. So what you can see now is for, in order to get this to work, you need to throw a teleportation grenade into the Plinko machine and what will it do it was it will move the kind of cone shape thing in the middle over to the left and that's what we need we need to start moving all this stuff over to the left so you throw that in you'll see the cone is now moved over to the left and now what you can see is where the grenade bit is at the top it's going to keep cycling through four different types of grenades you should be very familiar with all the icons for all these grenades and we need to do specific orders in order for us to be able to move our grenade over to the right side so that for this first one that you just saw here you need to change it so it's a distraction drone so you have this kind of like spinny dial thing on the first uh, kind of like row then you need to just throw a normal frag and what that will do is the distraction drone kind of like uh, propellers will kind of uh, spin the grenade over onto the other side that's a pretty simple one and after that it's going to reset so you need to throw another teleportation grenade in to move it over to the left now this next one is a little bit trickier but all of this will be down below in the description for you guys so it's very easy for you now for the second one the first thing you need is an explosive drop and these are kind of like the very kind of small skinny blue icons these are explosive drones you need that to be the first one then you need to throw a grenade in when it's on a distraction drone so then it will have the spinny propellers again then you need to get it onto another explosive drone uh, or the explosive drop and then you need a normal frag drop after that and that should move it down from the second one over to the right now this last one is very very difficult and it's taken me about 15 attempts to do because the plico machine the like holes that it has get smaller and smaller and you need to time this stuff very very well it's very easy to kind of uh, overstretch where your grenade actually aims and where it goes so for this one it's going to be an explosive drone as your first one then you need to throw it in when there's a nano swarm so that's the kind of small blue grenade then you need to get it again on an explosive drone then you need to get it on a distraction drone which is the big one with the propellers then you need another explosive drone and then followed by a normal frag at the end and what that should do is that it should drop the grenade all the way to the bottom where it will be shot over by the distraction drone it's very confusing but once you get the order down it should be quite simple but I'm sure there's some sort of expertise in getting the angles right to make sure that these grenades always go in first time but like I said it's very random because the Plico machine has different sized holes all the time no matter what you do with this and uh, another massive tip is that if you leave the Plico machine for too long like if you just uh, run away from it and, and kill some zombies in another area very slowly each step of progress you've done on the plico machine and that specific um uh grenade that you're trying to get over to the right will um will like delete itself and you need to make sure that you stay near it and so in fact that this doesn't reset because you don't want it to reset because then things get even more confusing but if at any point you do mess up um with your steps all you need to do is just throw the grenade in at a normal frag drop and most of the time that should reset your progress so that way you can redo any steps that you may have missed but once you manage to do this you'll get yourself a little tablet and you need to go over to the gun deck and there's going to be a massive vault and you're going to hear I'll speak to you if you've not heard this yet and then once you have heard this you can then insert that pad in and you'll see a light light up on the vault this is a much difficult easter egg than the previous two easter eggs so make sure to subscribe guys if you're new around here to keep yourself updated with the parts of this easter egg as we get more into it as I said below there's a playlist link so if you've missed out on any they'll be linked there and the, you'll also be able to find the next part in the description and annotated on screen as well but if you guys enjoyed this and it helped you out smash that like button let me know where you are at in this easter egg and I'll hopefully catch you on another video very very soon 